the Sandman. Cool, huh? Um, I was just mucking around with it. I was just listening to it, and um, I thought I'd um, quickly whack on a tutorial just uh, to show you how you can do the intro. I looked at a couple of other tutorials for this, and um, I mean, although they're probably the correct way to do it, I didn't really like the way that that was done. I thought there's an easy way, so um, I wanted to show you. Um, trick for this one is this fourth finger, all right, on the fifth string, put it up on the seventh, it's going to stay on the fifth string. You're going to slide it up and down the fretboard, but it's never going to come off, all right? So that's the trick. Okay, put it on there now. The work's going to be done with the second and third fingers. Um, and uh, obviously it's all done on the bass string, so sixth, fifth, and fourth are really the only ones you're going to play for the intro anyway. Um, there's three little chunks that you need to master to get uh, the intro. First part goes like this, I'll just do it slowly. Alright, the other part you're going to need is a bit that goes like this. Okay, so let's just show you those little three little bits once at a time. Okay, as I said, fourth uh, finger goes onto the fifth uh, string, seventh fret. Second finger goes onto the fifth fret, fourth string. All right, there's going to be a lot of this um, where the you're just going to be two frets apart, basically. So you play open E. So sixth, fifth, fourth. This third finger then comes up onto the uh, sixth fret on the E string. Then lift your second up off the fourth string and put it up onto the sixth. All right. And then after you've played that note, bring it straight back down to the fourth again and repeat. So. Staying there, it's not moving. When you play that last, you can kind of hit those both if you like. If you like that fuller sound. Right. Then when you're going to slide down to this next bit, you're in that formation still there. Slide it down two frets. And then basically you're just going to be releasing off the E to do some hammer, sort of hammer on. So play those two, open E, slide down two, oh, sorry, slide down one fret, release again, on and off twice, slide the whole thing up one, down one again. Then you can either come slide back up here again, just go back into that, or when you're there you can slide it down, just play that open like that as well, and then slide that again straight back up here to get back into that. So, if you want to do it that way, or just, you know. you need now is just the so again that fourth is just going to slide back down on the uh, fifth string down to the second fret and open E and then effectively just sliding it up one fret and then first finger comes onto the E string here and then back down again like that. with the strum though um, Use the inside of your palm just to mute those down strokes. And then give a bit of a whack on that um, E when you come up to that bit. Then you're going to slide back up into the... See, so you're going to be 
sliding up and down, so just leave that finger on there, that's the key. Right, um, anyway, now I've got to learn the rest of it, don't know anymore, so um, anyway, I uh, hope you like that, and um, yeah, get into it, see you later.